in this video i am going to tell you some of the important questions for june and december exam of ibo 02 international marketing management which is a subject of mcom first year ignu and the first question is different methods of pricing used in international marketing and what are the factors that should be taken into consideration while pricing for overseas markets the second question is on international marketing planning is difficult than domestic market planning comment on the statement and explain the decision areas for international marketing planning the third question is on marketing research and what are the techniques involved in overseas marketing research the fourth question is on objectives of branding and what are the various branding strategies used by firms and explain your answer with examples the fifth question is on emerging trends and issues in international marketing the sixth question is on distribution channels which are the link between producers and customers comment and discuss the various types of intermediaries associated with both direct and indirect methods the seventh question is on risk involved in the new product development explain with example and discuss the process of product development the next question is on selection of target markets that is the first stage in international market explain the statement and explain the factors that influence international market selection the next question is on barriers which make controlling international operations more complex than controlling domestic marketing activities explain this with examples the next question is on cultural environment and what is the significance of culture in international business decisions and discuss the important social ethical and environmental issues in international business the next question is on information technology that is and discuss how the use of internet and e-commerce has impact did the international business of a firm the next question is on issues in international marketing communication and what are the problems faced by an exporter in international marketing communication the next question is on overseas agent and what are its advantages offered by an overseas agent to the exporter and what are the steps involved in identifying an agent the next question is on factors which determine pricing decisions in international markets and what are the pricing methods used in international market the next question is on factors that should be taken into account before taking a decision as to go for direct or indirect exports The next question is on global competitive environment and examine where the whether the small enterprises have scope in the global business environment or not. The next question is on significance of ethical practices in business transactions and briefly examine the unethical practices adopted in international marketing. The next question is on characteristics of services and differentiate them from your product identify the services where india has export potential and the next question is on strategic alternatives for entering a foreign market available to an international marketer explain and state the relative advantages and disadvantages of each of these entry modes the next question is on short notes that is a uh, international marketing orientation eprg approach 
and international product life cycle general agreement on trade in services that is gats transfer pricing stratified sampling and the next question is on difference that is on joint venture and strategic alliance licensing and franchising warranty and guarantee manufacturers brand and distributors brand selling and marketing these are some of the questions made by our channel all things you want to watch you can email us and for more updates join us on youtube all things you want to watch thank you if you like this video then don't forget to hit like option comment share and subscribe our channel and share with your friends so that they will also be benefited with these questions thank you so much